and welcome to this educational video all about the importance of getting your eyes checked and how your eyes are very closely linked to your brain. My name's Martha, I'm an orthoptist and I deal with patients who have lazy eyes, double vision, any kind of eye muscle problem or blurry vision. We all know it's important to have our eyes checked at least once a year. Children under the age of eight are particularly at risk of developing an easily missed vision disorder known as amblyopia. Vision tests done in primary school will screen for amblyopia and ensure a prompt referral to the hospital for treatment. What is amblyopia, I hear you ask? Well, let's get into it in a little bit more detail. Between the ages of zero and eight, your vision is still developing. The cells at the back of your eye need focused light to stimulate them and allow them to grow and develop. This then allows the vision sensing part of your brain to also develop and give you clear vision. Amblyopia is a vision development disorder, meaning light is not focused properly so the eye cells cannot develop and the vision sensing part of your brain remains unstimulated and underdeveloped, resulting in blurry vision. Between the ages of 0 to 8, your vision is very plastic and can be changed if need be. So this is the perfect time to try to tackle amblyopia before your vision is set in stone. Sometimes the only thing that's needed to treat amblyopia is glasses and that's because the image that falls on the back of your eye might not be focused properly and therefore the image that's sent to the back of the brain is interpreted as blurry. So by giving you the correct glasses prescription, it sharpens up that image and tells your brain that you're seeing clearly. Once your child has settled into the glasses, we'll recheck the vision and check for any residual amblyopia. We can then start thinking about introducing occlusion therapy. Amblyopia is commonly only in one eye meaning when you cover up the weaker eye, the vision stays nice and clear because you are using your dominant eye. If we cover up the dominant eye, then you will become aware of the blurrier vision which your brain has essentially been ignoring this whole time. The way we treat amblyopia is by putting a patch over your child's dominant eye. That encourages the weaker eye to do a little bit more work and stimulate the underdeveloped part of the brain. This is how your child will see when they are wearing an eye patch. Your orthoptist will tell you how much to wear the patch each day until your next appointment. It's important to know that it will be blurry in the beginning and your child may not like wearing the patch. There is an alternative to patching, which requires an eye drop that's put into the stronger eye to blur the vision and again allow the weaker eye to do more work. At each visit to the orthoptist, you will see your child's vision getting better and better and better. The more the patch is worn, the more the visual cortex is stimulated and over time the vision in the weaker eye will improve and it will become easier to wear the patch. Before you know it, your child will forget all about the patch and their vision will be getting clearer by the day, allowing them to enjoy life to the fullest.